Santa Barbara County says it has hit a new record of registered voters. 227,000 voters are registered and that number is expected to keep growing. KSBY News reporter Alex Gonzalez is live in Santa Maria with what's new this election season. Alex? Well, good evening, Karina. The biggest thing to note is that if you still haven't registered to vote or submitted your ballot, you still have time to do so. Every election, I'm very proud to, look, to vote. I think it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's our right, but it's also a great privilege to vote in every election, and I make sure to do it every election. This election, I decided to vote by mail. Like Ritter, many people in Santa Barbara County are casting their ballots by mail. 80% of registered voters, according to the Santa Barbara County Clerk Recorder. In the past, if you missed the voter registration deadline, you simply didn't get to vote. But now, same-day registration and re-registration change that. Voters can now update their registration information, including their political party preference, and cast their ballot through Election Day. Every person that should be registered and should vote, I think this election is extremely important to the direction this country goes in the next four years. As of Thursday afternoon, the county had received around 49,000 mail-in ballots, but the county clerk recorder says he suspects there are many undecided voters due to the Democratic presidential primary. I'm waiting until the last debate, which was Tuesday, and now I'm going to wait until the voting in South Carolina is over with, and then I will vote. I'm voting by uh, ballot, by mail-in ballot. Now, no party preference voters can get a crossover ballot for the Democratic, Libertarian or Independent parties. If, however, they do want to vote on a Republican ballot, they will have to re-register. Live in Santa Maria, I'm Alex Gonzalez, KSPY News. Alex, thank you. And as we reported on Tuesday, San Luis Obispo County also has a record number of registered voters, 174,000. The clerk recorder says about a quarter of those voters have already returned their ballots.